How are we doing, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to Season 2 of the Milan Career Mode. As I have dirt in my eye, I gotta friggin' blink it out. Oh my goodness. Uh, if you haven't watched the last episode of our Milan Career Mode, you probably have, considering as the last episode of Season 1. I highly recommend you go check that out. Uh, who did we play? I can't remember who exactly we played, but we got like... Oh, sorry, who was it? Oh my god. The team friggin' um, Candreva plays for. Oh, Salternera, however you say it. Uh, yeah. Oh my goodness. But, anyways, new season here with Milan. Uh, I'll show you the starting lineup that we'll be rocking with to start this uh, season. Uh, this is before we make any signings. I mean, Jovic and Krunic are both on the move, so be prepared for that. We've got a lot of players back on loan, so. Some extra money we can make there, but uh, yeah, I have everybody who I want to move on or want to move somewhere else or just want them to get out of this club. Uh, I have them all loan listed or transfer listed. Every Everything's looking pretty well in shape here, but yeah, I mean, if you look at the team's crap, wrong button. Uh, if you look at the squad hub going into this season, um, Manyal is obviously the highest rated. Teo Hernandez and Rafa Leal make up our highest rated on the left-hand side. Schlotterbeck is going up crazy ratings, man. Partnered with Fiaco Tamori, Ismail Benassa, Danny Olmo, Chiquese. We got some great players here on this team, man. But looking at this lineup, I definitely do think there's some positions we can improve upon. And that's what we're going to do here today. We're going to look to improve upon some positions that need to be addressed well i wouldn't say need to be we have a really great team that won Serie A last season but i want to improve on what we got and that's what i want to do here with milan today so without further ado let's get this thing started well ladies and gentlemen i would like to welcome our first new signing of season two a new striker joins the squad julian alvarez will lead the line for AC Milan in 2024 into 25. I'm excited about this one, man. I'm excited to have Julian Alvarez on board. You can see him chatting up with Teo Hernandez and Mike Magnon. But Julian Alvarez, welcome to AC Milan. I take... I'm not going to lie to you, it's going to suck to take Mukoko out of the starting 11, but I want to have two great striking options in. Julian Alvarez joins from Man City for $77 million. Good price for a great overall player. I'm really happy we have Julian Alvarez. We can play him on the wing if we need to. I'm, I'm just really happy we got Julian Alvarez in the team, man. We'll put... What we'll do is we'll drop a Rigi to... Or we'll put... Mukoko on the bench. Alvarez leads the line. And I think that significantly proves this lineup, man. Because, I mean, I, I love Mukoko. I really do. But I feel, just feel like having a higher rated striker is something that will help this team out. And Julian Alvarez is a great striker to have leading the line. So, I'm sorry you're a backup now, Mukoko. But Julian Alvarez, welcome to AC Milan. Well, here's another player out the door. I don't know who this is. It is, I think it's Salamakers. Yep, Salamakers is going to Crystal Palace. He spent the year on loan at Atalanta. And Salamakers is off to Crystal Palace. He's off to join the Premier League. So, more money in the books. Pellegrino's going on loan. A two-year loan, respectively, to Borussia Mönchengladbach. Man, we've got great squ squad depth at center back. What do you even mean? I hope we have more players going out the door. Who is this one leaving? This is Lorenzo Colombo. He's going to Fenerbahce on a $19 million transfer. Uh, is there any others? Charles de Cal Calerte is going to Roma for $33 million. M more money. Uh, best of luck to every all those guys. But yeah, more money in the bank for us, I guess. More more outgoings. They're happening a lot this year. Uh, one of our Youth Academy prospects is off to... I don't even know where on loan, but... I mean, hopefully it's safe out there for him. I'm, 
I pity the guy, but hopefully he's safe out there and God knows where. Another player sold. Who is this one? This is Matteo Gabbia. He's going to Swasolo for $11.2 million. More outgoings, man. We're cleaning up the depth of this squad this year with all the friggin' lone players that we had. I must say, but... Uh, sure, you, Swansea, you can have him on loan. Uh, there we go. This is what I want. No loan to buys. We just want... We just want loans here. We just want loans. Well, more outgoings, I believe. Who is this? Well, I can't remember his name. Eek... Bro, that don't look like Aguirre, eh? He's going on loan to Spezia. Uh, who else did we get rid of? Brian's going on loan to wherever the hell that is. Um, okay. Who else? Fode Balotore. Yaya's third cousin. He's going to the Saudi League. Uh, get your bag there, bro. Hopefully you enjoy Saudi and yeah. That's about that, and another signing confirmed. That's what I like. Welcome to AC Milan, Bruno Gimmerich. A but our new midfielder is here. That's what I love to see. Welcome to Milan, Bruno. All I'm just signing my Premier League rivals players at this point. Uh, Bruno Gimmerich joins from Barcelona for 115 million. Bruno Gimmerich now stars in this midfield. We've got a hell of a midfield with Danny Olmo, Bruno Gimmerich, and Ismail Benasser. Bruno Gimmerich will wear number eight for AC Milan, and he is going to look real good in our starting lineup. I'm going to say that much. Bru Man, red suits you, Bruno Gimmerich. I ain't even going to lie. Red suits you, my friend. But... Okay, come on, so let's skip. We don't need to do all this fun stuff. There we go. We can just go straight to team management. Ruben Loftus Cheek drops to the bench and bring in Bruno Gemmerich to the starting eleven. Man, this this lineup's looking improved. I'll say that. I'm really liking where this is going. I must say, I really do like where this is going, guys. I think we've got a solid, solid season on hands. We're upgrading at positions of need. I mean, kinda sucks that Loft his cheeks going back to a backup after that 30 yard screamer he scored for me in the last episode. But oh well, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. And Bruno Gimmerich now joins AC Milan. Oh my god, man. Look at this team, bro. We are going to kill it this season. We are going to kill it. And just like that, another player departs. Divock Origi is going to Brentford. That will actually suit Divock Origi. Hello, well. I mean, more money in the bank for us. Divock Origi is off to Brentford. Enjoy life back in the Premier League, my friend. And another signing for AC Milan. Fiaco Tamori's going to get a friend because Reese James has joined. AC Milan, our new starting right back, is here. Oh boy, oh boy. We are building something special this season. Something special is happening. Reese James joins from Bayern Munich for 77 million. Oh man, have a look at this. Uh, get me to team management. Get me to team management now. I want. Uh, Oh, I got an A on the price rating. Perfect. But put Calabria in there. We'll put like Traore there because I don't want Florenzi to go down that far. We're building something special here, guys. Something special's being built. I don't know. I don't know what you have to say. But something special's being built here in Milan. We've got something cooking. I'll say that much. Something is cooking in the Italian North West. Yeah, it'll be the Italian Northwest. Oh my god, man. Something is cooking. Something is cooking. I will say that much. Well, well, well. We After all that, we've arrived at game number one of the season. We're only going to play this first game today, so this video isn't like three hours long. 
But big game today. We're taking on Empoli here in Serie A at the San Siro. We'll kick off at home. Yeah, it's going to be good to give these guys some debuts. Not a single player under 84 in the starting 11. Oh my god, get me into this game, man. This is going to be something good. A new beginning, the opening match day of the season, and a keen sense of optimism enveloping everyone. Who will come out on top? We have all the action for you live on EA TV. That really all right welcome to the san siro everyone Zero welcome Milan. back for a Derek new Ray. season of the milan career mode it is time we are underway season Rosson. two and new signings new players here's one of them now come on reese james reese james wins the ball back it's milan uh, and they take on he's linking well, up well with his friend oh crap he's lost the ball reese 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 reese's pieces don't let let them score. Bruno Gimaraes. What a challenge. This is the impact I want from the new boys. Let's go. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. Empoli are in here. Tomori, get back. I don't know why they've ran so far wide. Crap. Oh, man. Y'all with a big save. Big save to start this game. Empoli chuck a long ball get downfield, and they get past Tomori. And they've won themselves a corner here. They're going to whip it in, I'm sure. Corner no one's short. Give in. it out. Merci beaucoup. The danger. It's a promising Milan move. Oh, here we go. Teo Hernandez. Whip that ball into the box. Alvarez. First shot, first goal. Julian Alvarez on the score sheet in his Milan debut. Julian Alvarez scores. Assisted by Teo Hernandez. That's the start we were looking for this season. Well, look this again. <laughs> it's a sweaty goal, but we'll take it. Teo Hernandez, he, fit, he fits it perfectly in the gap of th three different defenders there. And Julian Alvarez is there to pounce at the end of it. It's a striker's goal. Julian Alvarez on the score sheet. First goal of the season goes to number nine, and it's 1-0 Milan. Oh crap, oh my god, we almost, Empoli almost leveled the score in there. Can never back down here in Serie A, I tell you. Last season will tell you everything you need to know about that, but, oh my goodness, good stop there from Yanyan. Crap, crap, in front. In it goes, he scored on his debut, and his fans are Oh, we're back to this now, are we? We're back to this. Really? Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then what a finish. How is Magnon not stop that, dude? The Why is Magnon no doing, like, it's the friggin' YMCA dance in the air? Like, dude, stop the ball. So underway again here oh. on the back of that level. Bloody hell. 1-1. One, one. That's a good pass. Oh, my. The There's no the way. They have never stopped oh my believing. God. And now Am I going to have to go through this again? Am I really going to have to deal with this crap again? Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. What? How is he left, left that wide it's open? Reese James, what a get in front of the ball if you're going to put your hands behind your back, man. Jesus. Oh, my God. Well, There's no way I'm, I have this to go through this again. There's so no way I'm going to have to deal with this can crap Milan again. There's the right no reply. way. Not a chance. Okay, a come on, Leal. Come on, Leal. Get us back even. Come on, Leal. Leal. There we go. You knew he was going to score at some point. Rafa Leal makes it 2-2. Two -two. We got a quick response. And the best person to get a quick response from is Rafa Leal. Great skill moves. Got past the last defender. And he finds the far post. Beautiful goal. Beautiful solo goal by number 10. Rafa Leal. And it's 2-2 at the San Siro. Game on for La Rafa Leal. away. Oh, Alvarez with the chance. Oh, it's 
great save there. The chance fell for Alvarez. I was like, I have to take it. It's a great save there by the keeper. I don't want... I mean, honestly, it's not a bad idea. I will, I will take Alvarez on corners, to be honest. Oh, that almost found Slaughter back in. Uh, oh, well. Good to know. Attacking possibilities. Oh, here we go. Come on, layout. Power forward, power forward, Leal. Power in. forward, Rafa Leal. It's a brace for Rafa Leal. A goal right before halftime. Leal hits the gritty, and he picks up right where he left off last season. Rafael Leal, how good is this young star? How good is he? Wow. 3 2, Leal cooks. Milan are rocking. Back in front. Let's go, Rafa Leal. Let's friggin' go. This should be half time here. Again, again. Now. Just Three, two. Go win what back the ball. Next? Let's win back this ball. We will have Come a couple on. of additional minutes at the end here. There we go. Can we have one last chance? Nope, that's gonna go straight. Oh no, it's gonna go straight Rafael to Leal. Leal. Come on, Alvarez. Ah. Okay, that'll be half time, surely. There we are. That's half time. 3-2, an exciting first half. Lots of goals to start this game, but the same man who made the difference last season is making the difference this season. We should be leading 3-0, but apart from those five minutes where we fell asleep defensively, we're playing a great game. Once Alvarez opened the scoring, the floodgates just opened from there, man. They really did, but... Goals from Alvarez and a brace from Leao are what got us ahead. Hopefully we can stay strong defensively and close out this second half. Well, Come on, Ross on here. Eddie. Milan with the advantage. But the oh, here we go. Jim Bruno Gimaraes. Oh, it's... Safe, yes! I was like, how did the keeper not pick that up? But it fell so straight to Julian Alvarez. Shoot, I'll take that any day of the week. Chiquese found Bruno Gimaraes from the half volley, and Julian Alvarez has a brace on his Milan debut. Now, how about that? That is that is splendid stuff. Oh, I don't know how the goalkeeper's not stopped or grabbed that, to be honest, but it's fallen for Julian Alvarez, and if it's there, I'm gonna take it. Brace for Alvarez on his debut. Brace well, for Rafa Leal, who will get a hat trick. We'll see. But great debut for Alvarez so, so far. 4 2. Oh, here we go. Chiquese. Oh, Chiquese. All of our front three are on the score sheet. How about that? Bruno Gimaraes with the assist, too. And it's Chiquese on the score sheet opens it up on his right foot to have that shot and it's in off the post well, there it is. let's have it's another look at this Chiquese right the opens up on his left power enough. shot on his right and in off the inside of the post not much that keeper can do and Milan have taken a 5-2 advantage in this one the high flying offense reigns again well they get the ball rolling again and meet Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Don't give this man that kind of space. Layal, it's six. Rafa Layal gets his hat trick. Number 10 scores again. And it's 6 2 for Milan. Three by Layal, two by Alvarez, one by Chiquese. What you can't ask for much more than this, can you? Rafa Leal gets his hat trick. It's a beautiful strike. Cuts inside. Finesse shot. The keeper knew where he was going, and he still couldn't save it. Huge, huge goal there. Well, it's the 60th minute. It's time to bring on some substitutions. Let's see. Um, I think Shaquese will be replaced by. Uh, Christian Pulisic. Um, let's see what I can do here. What can I do here, I wonder? Let's give the 4-4-3 attack a run. We'll move Alvarez to Cam. Ukoko will replace um, Olmo. Um, 
I know it's cheesy bringing two strikers on, but I really want to see Alvarez complete the whole game for his debut. Uh, Reese James, I know, can be terrible with stamina, so Cal Calabria will replace him. Uh, what do I even do here? Um, hmm. I'll give Benassar a rest. Uh, we'll put Rangers alongside Gimaraish. And we'll give one of the center backs a rest too. Uh, we'll give Tamori a break for Kalulu. I like that. Let's continue so on, boys. Come remaining. on. Milan recovering possession well. Oh my god, Alvarez got a hat trick too. I just had a shot because it opened up. And man, I'm telling you, we've got a squad. We've got a squad. We've got a squad. Alvarez hat trick on this debut. We are absolutely flying well, today. To say, this Kwese is a really good takes the pass to Alvarez. Well Alvarez from outside the box. Pressure, I seen the space, so I had a crack. And Alvarez gets his hat trick. What a strike on that left foot. Julian Alvarez scores. Milan seven. Empoli two. And my God, what a team we've got on our hands. And we've got the Champions League and tied Serie A top goal scorer coming off the bench. Oh, this is a team, man. We've got some freaking team this year, guys. Good looking cross. Well, oh, jeez. What a save that, that was. Get a few skills to play out. I don't know who got oh, up for that header, but it was a corner. beautiful save by the keeper. Oh, was, I think it was Teo Hernandez still in the box, but... Great save there by the Empoli keeper. He's conceded seven, but... Got to get rid of it. Okay, I don't know what happened there. But oh well, I guess I shouldn't have watched the whole replay. But one to give the Empoli goalkeeper his props. That's a great save, man. Oh my god, the pace on and Alvarez. He's going to go get himself a fourth. Julian Alvarez oh, is How's he done that, man? We've got a stud on our hands here. Has he nutmegged that last defender too? I think he might have. <laughs> I think the goalkeeper saved it with his head, but might as well just play it short, man. The game's about to be called. Just play it to friggin Alvarez. Play it back to Leal. Leal. Cross in. Keeper's caught it, now but it doesn't really it's matter. Final, and we can Games say that set Milan and done. 7 2 win to start the season. Yeah, Five result, total shots for Leal, and forward, three of them found they the back of the net. Rafa Leal, man, what more can I say? The dude is too good. The dude is too good. 7 2 win for Milan. I love it, man. I absolutely love it. Well, as deadline day rounds to a close, we don't... Nothing's gonna happen here. Um, yeah. Um, oh, a transfer offer for Tia. I don't know why you're making it so late, Juventus, but I'm not selling Tia. My bad. Sorry that you want him now, but... Oh, well... Deadline day is over. Um, we have a match day against Bologna here on the first day of September. And they're right behind us in the league. I mean, then again, this is also, the, we've only played one game this season. Swasolo played two and won two. So, good for them. They're off to a good start, but... We got to sure up that defensive record, man. Once we sure up that defensive record, things will be looking better for us. We'll take a look at these real quick. I'll release this guy because his potential's going low. Same with Pacheco. <laughs> I'm just realizing that guy it was le like the Argentinian version of Isaiah Pacheco on the Chiefs. It's kind of funny because it says run uh, right back, but in American football terms, that's running back. But... That, that, I just found that really funny. I just found that really funny. But, uh, yeah, guys. If you enjoyed this episode of the Milan Career Mode, smash that like button. Uh, what do we have up ahead of us? No announcement on Champions League yet. That'll be interesting. But 
looks like in the next episode, we'll probably play Bologna and Napoli, I'd say. But we'll probably have a Champions League game somewhere and around there. So that'll probably be in the next episode. But until next time, guys, I will see you for Bologna in the next episode. Take care and peace.